We have two brand new colors from Da Vinci. Um, they just came out with a neutral tint, and to be completely honest, I did not realize Da Vinci did not have a neutral tint. I've used their paints gray, and I have all their neutrals, and I just, I don't know, I never had that like light bulb moment, moment that that was missing. So that's good, and it looks very similar to Daniel Smith, and I'll show you that as well. I'll do a little swatch of Daniel Smith so you can compare. And then we have Da Vinci's Joyce's Mother Green. This color is not like any other green. So when I looked at my greens, it looked like Sennelier's Olive Green was close, but there's too much yellow in that and too much brown in this. So this isn't like any other green. So in a few weeks, um, I'm gonna go ahead and do a comparison with this and it's gonna mostly be Daniel Smith paints that are um, the jewel tones because that's all it really matches. It doesn't match any other mixed greens and I really do like it, so. Um, let's take a look at both of these. So I'm going to do the neutral tint first. And I'm going to go ahead and wet the paper first. So it's, it's really dark. So I want to This is definitely a lot darker, I think, than the Daniel Smith. This must have a lot of black in it. Do the Daniel Smith. I'm not going to do as big of a swatch, but just so you can compare. Yeah, this has a lot more blue in it. It's funny, I used the Daniel Smith one because it was the most neutral color that I had as far as um, Payne's Gray and Neutral Tints go. And I wanted something that didn't have like a blue in it so that it would truly neutralize my colors. But putting this next to the Da Vinci, it looks really, really blue. I guess I am going to do the same size swatch. I didn't know I was going to. Okay. I need to do something about this water. I'm already getting blooms. Okay. 
Okay, hopefully that works out. Doesn't look as... I'm gonna leave it alone. Okay, so... The Joyce's Mother Green is the one I was really excited about. So this one has PG7, PY42, sorry, and PBR7. So that explains why it has that brown and yellow look. just wash so we can really see this color. This is such a like natural looking color that you could really get away with not mixing this with anything. Even like sap greens, I don't feel that way about, but this one is special. This is the new Da Vinci Neutral Tint. And I'm gonna do it again, kind of like this, where you can't see the Daniel Smith. Because I really do think that makes a difference. Okay, so now let's look at the Joyce's Mother Green. And then the wash. And I just really think this is a pretty color. Okay, so these are all dry. Um, yeah, that Da Vinci Neutral Tint is seriously dark, but there are people who don't want to use black um, that are going to have a really good option now because it does have three pigments in it, and it doesn't have that flatness that you would get with just straight black. Um, I do like the Daniel Smith neutral tint, but I can see how blue it is now, but at the same time, if I cover this one, you can see how neutral it really is, unless you put it next to something that's reasonably black. So, um, I guess I'm happy with this. I'm glad to have a really dark option. Now look, let's look at the Joyce's Mother Green because I really, really love this color. So I really do think you could use this as your all-in-one green. 
Um, it obviously won't replace Perlene Green or Phthalo Green, but you could um, add colors to it to make a sap green, to make a hooker's green, to make an olive green. It sort of has a perfect base to go in all those directions. Normally I would say like a sap green you couldn't turn into an olive, but I feel like this you could. And once again, you can use this without mixing anything in it. It really does look natural. Um, I find like with M. Graham with the hooker's green and sap green, sometimes I'll use them on their own and I'll even mix them together to make a dark. It just makes it easier when you have a green that's already natural. And um, obviously Da Vinci is a really good price. So these are their new colors, Neutral Tint and Joyce's Mother Green. And I hope this was helpful. Thank you.